I'm so excited. I'm about ready to go into Dollar Tree. I can't wait to see what they have out for summer 2021. Dollar Tree has all of their 4th of July stuff out. I noticed they had all of this new kind of like BPA plastic where I'm loving these bowls. They're really thick and a high quality plastic. I definitely think we could do something with these. I love all these chalk writing markers at Dollar Tree. My favorite is the white one, but you can get them in silver and gold and a variety of colors. Look at this one. This is a chalkboard paint. We're going to try this one out. So I'm going to take the two bowls that I grabbed and next I'm going to stack the larger one on top of the smaller one. I'm going to use the Dab Rapid Fuse Fast Curing Gel because this sets up in about 30 minutes and I'm going to put a bead on the base and then put the bowl on top. I'll let that set for a while. Then I'm going to come back in with that Dollar Tree chalkboard paint. I was really excited to use this. I'm using a foam brush and putting on about two coats. I let each coat dry in between before I added an additional coat. Next, I'm gonna use that chalk writer from Dollar Tree and just put some fun little hash marks along the edge. And this is how I styled it on my coffee table. Now in the garden section, I love these little floral scissors. These are great, they work really well, only a dollar. Now I haven't tried their shears, so let me know down in the comments if you guys like the shears at Dollar Tree. Make sure you check out all of the party sections. I'm over in the grad section. They have these adorable little floating frames. You can put a four by four picture in there. So cute. I'm gonna use those scissors I picked up and I'm going to take out the back components of the floating frame. I printed off a picture and color that I had on my computer and I'm just going to cut it out so it's the size of the four by four frame. Next, I'll just put it into the frame and I'm also going to add that backing piece to put a little white border around the edge. And this is just a fun way to add a picture. You could put this in your kid's room or anywhere. It would also make a fun gift. So I want to tell you guys about today's sponsor, Drop. Drop is a rewards app that is available on your Android or iOS. Drop is rewarding the lives of over 40 million members every single day. I love using Drop whenever I'm shopping because I can earn points by buying things that I was already going to buy. You can also play games or do surveys to earn points as well. I recently used the Drop app before I was buying an order on Sephora. You earn points in the Drop app anytime you spend things you were normally going to buy anyways. So when I shop at Sephora, I can earn 40 points for every dollar I spend. So if I spend $100 at Sephora, I'm going to earn 4,000 points. So it's super easy anytime you're gonna shop, all you have to do is open your Drop app, go to the Shop tab, tap on the offer, and then tap Shop Now. Then you're just gonna complete your checkout process like normal. And then Drop just automatically adds the points to your account. So I actually have about 31,000 rewards points right now in my Drop app, and I'm saving up because I want to buy a $50 Amazon gift card for 50,000 points. I'm really excited for that. I think I think once I get to 50,000 points, I'm gonna use them to purchase the chandelier for my front entryway on Amazon that I've been eyeing. So I'm super excited to cash in the points that I earn just by shopping normally by having the Drop app. I really don't even have to think about finding coupons or anything. I know that I'm gonna get rewards points back anytime I go through the Drop app. Drop also has this feature called stackable deals. So you get the rewards points whenever you shop, but you can also get additional deals at the time of checkout. So you really get to like double dip with your deals. Drop is a totally free app to download. Plus you get the benefits of earning the rewards points and you can earn gift cards. Like I'm getting ready to earn my first gift card. 
card. So I have my link down in the description box. And when you sign up, link your debit or credit card. For a limited time, Drop is giving away all of my subscribers 10,000 points, which equals $10 when you sign up in rewards. If you download the app through the App Store or Google Play, just use my code LizF. And your bonus is gonna be deposited after you earn your first thousand reward points. So check out all the links down below. You can definitely stock up on all of your summer needs. You can get awesome things like sidewalk chalk, as well as some really fun sand and pool toys. Love this ice bucket. So many DIY potentials. I'm definitely gonna grab at least one if not two of these. You guys, I'm totally blown away by these. These are really nice plastic and they have so much DIY potential. So I wanted to show you one use after I got all of those annoying stickers off. I thought they'd be great in your fridge to store fruit. I'm definitely gonna be using these as well in some upcoming DIYs. I love this cute little daydreamer bag. They also have another style as well. So I'm gonna check the paints and see if there's any that I don't currently have. I picked up several on my last trip here. What do you guys think of these acrylic paints? I, they're okay to me, I'm not totally in love. So I always stop by the Crafter Square. Now ours is pretty picked over because I'm here on a Monday, but I found a new item I haven't seen before. It's an 11 by 14 canvas. Now it's not thick. I haven't seen any canvases this size, so we're gonna pick it up and do a DIY. So I'm gonna start by painting this entire canvas. I had this blue moon milk paint that I really love the color for. I bought it off of Amazon, I'll link it for you down below. And I'm just gonna do two coats on the entire canvas with this paint. So I found these little wood picks the last time I was at Dollar Tree and I just thought they would make a really cool wall art. Now honestly you guys, I wasn't sure if this would turn out. I wanted them to be in a circle shape. So I first started just by laying them out to see if it would even look right. I decided that I wanted to do all the gold little beads about the same distance from each other. Once I got kind of the positioning figured out, I came in with the DAP Rapid Fuse Gel to put them on there. And I, you can see I just put a little bit of gel at the base and then I'm putting the little picks on top of it. What I like about this over hot glue is it's gonna dry and you're not gonna be able to see it. Plus, I was able to position it and I didn't have to have it perfect right away. But this is how it turned out and I think it makes a really cool wall art piece. Oh my goodness, okay. These are new and so awesome. These little greenery pods. So they have this style that's kind of like a boxwood. They also have these little ferns and this one. I think that I'm gonna grab these two and I'll show you how I style them. Make sure when you go to Dollar Tree that you check the hardware section because they have these self-adhesive wall tiles. They come in several different types. I've been looking for these like white subway tiles and haven't been able to find them, but I finally found them. So make sure you check because they're really cool. I'm over in like the breakable items and I just found these cool little containers. They have these little concrete bases. One's a rectangle, one's a triangle. So cute, we're definitely picking them up. These were such a great find and are gonna look so high end. So I added some of that Rapid Fuse gel to the base to hold the little gold piece in place. I ended up adding way too much glue, so I would suggest putting just a few dots in the corners. Now I wanted to show you two ways to style this. So what you could do is you could use the triangle ones as pin holders. So I have them here on a desk. I'm just adding in some pins and I think they just look so adorable. So another thing you could do with the one that's the shape of a rectangle is you could actually use it as a soap holder in your bathroom. So I grabbed this soap container at Dollar Tree. I'm gonna spray paint it with two coats of a matte black spray paint. That's all I did. I just made sure it was completely covered and look how cool this looks in my bathroom.
I know it's controversial, but I like to pick up my foam brushes at Dollar Tree. I get this size and then I also get the smaller ones as well. In the kitchen section, they also have these cute little flip top lids, a set of three for a dollar. You could use these for spices or snacks, really cute. Dollar Tree has this really cool new organization. They have this one, they have a little bigger shape and then a smaller one. We're gonna get these and organize. I was so impressed with the quality of these organizers. They fit perfectly in a desk drawer to organize things. You could use these in so many places around your house. I hope you guys had fun shopping with me today at Dollar Tree. Let me know down in the comments what item you're gonna be looking for at your Dollar Tree. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe. I post two DIYs each week. And if you missed our last video, I'll link it here for you. And I'll talk to you guys in our next one. Bye.